ahead a little bit. And guess what I found? A friggin' monster. He's on the bridge. <gasps> He's still there. He is still there. Let's see if he can break this door down. who are under treatment. The people you send for will end up here. Remember that the confinement itself works as a preamble to the torture, and you should pace yourself. Don't take anyone before they are ready. Understood. Sounds from the torture chambers are shuttled in through those pipes in the ceiling. Manage your victims well, and let one prisoner's pain instill terror in his cellmate. insane. Vicious, vicious man. Where are these damn pipes going to go? Oh crap, there's the pipe there. Wow. Okay, well, I guess I'm gonna have to go back here. Run past the guy. Oh man, this is an awful loading screen. Not a happy camper right now. Come on, loading screen, give me. Is he gone? He's gone. Oh, the door's not broken. Well, that's interesting. He's probably still out here somewhere. I wonder if that sets him back over there. options to do here. Oh, this time we're gonna go left. Let's see if we can make it without him. This is crazy. Banishment ritual is taking longer than expected, and we have to do what is needed. I spend my time helping out the prisoners. Being around these degenerates makes me ill. None of them even tries to face their punishment with any kind of dignity. They taunt me with their lies of innocence and their cowardly pleas of mercy. What can make a man fall so far from the grace of a civilized existence? They are all wicked men, and I remind myself of it constantly. Still, I am thankful for God sending these monsters our way, as they will serve as the instruments of my salvation. I try to study the different tools in the torture chamber and learn how to use them effectively. Last time was messy, and the effect suffered from my inexperience. When the next warding is to be performed, I shall be ready. Okay, I think you're being led astray, my friend. Seriously, like... Never time. Alright, oh, I got that, uh, what did I pick up there? Wooden bucket filled with sticky tar. Jesus, 
Barrier blocks the passage in the chancel because the chancel is a depression that can fit the orb. The grip of the dying man seems okay, so maybe that's where the orb goes. We can find it and piece it together. Alright, I'm gonna go to that. Shattered or all is lost, I must once again start over ever since I recovered the orb first found by Agrippia. I have depended on it for my research. The incident with Wilhelm helped me. So where the hell did you break it? Like where did you leave all the bits and pieces, my friend? Because I need it. Okay, this is not too creepy. Um, this is probably a ritual room of some sort. It's not letting me do anything with it. Alrighty then. Lots of symbols on the back here. Yeah, they uh, turn. 
turkey leg. Scare there, he broke the door down. Maybe she knows. He came back, the door is back up. There you had not been plundered. Do you know me, Well, I suppose it doesn't matter. It is a... Did he use this handle? It's old thing, building temples out of it. I thought that was so close. Caverns. The Dark Wars being the universe. And inside are its followers. Humans watching the sky slowly turn. But the followers do have one thing to allow them a real sense of connection, creation, some orbs. Alexander took it and brought it to Brennerberg. Let's try. That chain looks suspiciously like it needs to be broken, but I don't know. Okay, we'll use chisel on it. No. No. That seriously looks like it's something, doesn't it? stack up these boxes. Cause why would they leave them all here? Seriously. It's not really something that you just leave. Fire was a brave man, and what dared to proceed that I did not. He unearthed a number of cavern temples and gathered a whole collection of orbs. But unlike every other finder since the fall of the Israel fame, he was able to unshackle the heart you and I connected with the orbs. He used them and was able to travel far and wide, beyond the world itself. Why would he do that? Me? Wait. Not the way I Are you serious? I've done all that I can to escape this prison. But now, I use all my strength merely to stay alive. Stack up stuff here. 
this obvious bench that blocks the box is on. The box is on. Said he found a way to take me with him beyond the stars. But I was too afraid to come home. Seriously. And now, all I can do is reflect it. But so does Alexander. That's why he keeps me here, as a hostage, hoping Vaya will reveal himself. Alright, man, you're yakking my ear off here. Seriously, you need to... You're a good boy, Dad. And I appreciate your company. But I believe you have more important things to take care of. Uh, yeah, I'm working on it. You are in my personal space. You should hurry, Daniel. No time for sitting around. Thanks, man. Thanks for pointing out the obvious. I don't know why. You're a good boy, Dad. And I appreciate your comfort. But I believe you have more important things to take care of. Alright, let's figure it out. You should hurry, Dad. No time for sitting around. You're a good boy, and I appreciate your company. But I believe you have more important things to take care of. You should hurry, Dad. No time for sitting oh. around. For sitting around. Grab it. You're a good boy, and I appreciate your company. But I believe you have more important things to take care of. Yes. Oh, come on, you can fly. You should hurry, Daniel. No time for sitting around. I'm assuming it's gonna work with one of these suckers. One of these doors is gonna open. It's gotta work. Chair. You should hurry, Daniel. Right. No time for sitting around. Good boy. 
and I appreciate you coming. I can't believe I'm spending but like I believe you have 10 minutes more important to party. Okay. Game. Game, game, game here. Why are you not fly? You should hurt that. No time for sitting around. Alright. I don't see how I can get a better case. Get up here. You're a good boy. And I have He's me? Appreciate you, Kampa. Jar. But I believe if yes. you have to, more important things to take care of. Oh. You should hurry, Daniel. No time for sitting around. Think? You're a good boy, and I appreciate you coming. But I believe you have more important things to take care of. Uh, okay. You should hurry, Daniel. No time for sitting around. 